Environment and agri-food here at Cranfield is a broad theme. We're interested in natural resources basically, land, soil and air. We're interested in the assessment of those resources, the evaluation, also the management and protection of those natural resources. We also look at the risks associated with those resources and policy and governance linked to land, soil and air. Cranfield is well placed to meet these challenges for a number of reasons. First we have academic staff, technical staff who are able to address some of these research challenges. We also have world-class facilities. But I think most importantly is the fact that we have very good relationships with external partners, whether it be in industry or other universities and research institutes. Cranfield University is unique in the UK because it focuses exclusively on graduate students. We need to work with some of the brightest and best scientists around the world and Cranfield Universities are one of the partners that we selected to work with on a long-term strategic basis. We have unique facilities that we use in environment and agri-food here. For example, we have a soil and water management facility which allows us to simulate every single step along the food chain right from cultivating the soil in the first place, right through to post-harvest technology where we have some of the best environmental science and analytical labs. And these facilities are available to our industrial partners, other academics and of course to our students. Industry links between Cranfield and companies, there's a good connection between them, which you don't always get at other universities. The part of environmental technology that is particularly relevant to my work is monitoring the state of our ecosystems. There, the opportunity that environmental technology opens up is um, using transferring methods from engineering disciplines such as computer sciences, uh, robotics and electronics to the environmental sciences and technology to make use of these advanced emerging technologies for uh, environmental protection purposes. We're in the soils lab. I've got these filter socks and by placing these at the bottom of slopes in agricultural land, we're hoping that we can adapt them to capture not just soil but also nutrients that are coming off of these lands before they go into the watercourses. And it will be one way to combat this issue of decreasing water quality. Cranfield University staff are great people to work with as partners for industrial R&D projects. They're business aware, they're flexible in their approach, and most important of all, they deliver. The work that we do in environment and agri-food here is able to shape the future in a number of ways. One is our fundamental and applied research has real impact for our industrial partners and our other partners outside of Cranfield. But I think one of the legacies that we have is that we are training a cohort of students and they are going out from Cranfield and able to apply some of the knowledge that they've gained while they're on courses here. I've been at Cranfield for over 30 years. I love what I do, I love my research. It is a researcher's dream to work in somewhere like Cranfield.